Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for March 2nd, 2021. Let's see what we have for today. Oh, there it is. Today we have a new romantic cycle begins, new moon in Libra. I'm sorry, I'm like cracking up already because I see this balancing. Um, this feels like scales of justice and this totally feels like maybe you've just gotten a communication with someone, whether it's a current love or a past love or it could be new. It could be new and you put a hard stop on something like they come in they think they're going to control this situation. You're like, uh, nope, <laughs> uh, nope. And that's part your boundary setting is the beginning of a new romantic cycle. Ooh, okay. So let's get into this. So if someone comes in and they're making a love offer, and you're like, oh, it seems really great. You could kind of, remember, don't, just don't move too fast. Make sure you are paying attention to your feelings and making sure it's going the way, you know what I mean, that feels comfortable for you, where you're not being forced to move in with somebody right away, or, you know, not forced, but, you know, encouraged to move in right away. But you're always remaining very, very balanced. Um, but this feels more like perhaps someone who was very toxic tries to come back to you or maybe there's some old toxic behavior coming out of uh, a current love partner and you set a boundary and it snaps the energy. It just snaps it. So if you're single and you've got somebody coming in and they're offering something and you're like, I feel it, I see it, you're not getting through, I'm done, right? Or you don't even have to say I'm done, you just have to say, yeah, I don't like how you're talking to me. Yeah, it seems like this is all the same old stuff. Just by doing that, you're showing the universe that you're truly ready for love and here it comes. Now, if you're in a partnership and the dynamic is not always equal and if you can do so safely, be careful with your situations out there. Not everybody's in a healthy situation. And of course, make sure you're getting proper support for that. But, uh, you know, if you feel like, you know what, I am tired of you just assuming I don't know how to do things. Please don't mansplain to me. All right, I'm done that kind of boundary setting might wake your love partner up and now a new romantic cycle begins where there's even some pressure off of, you know, if you're like, if you're dating a man or with a man or whatever, <laughs> just, it's just one example. But um, it might be where you spark some awareness in this person and they're like, oh, you know, I, I didn't realize I was doing that. Yes. So something that you thought you had to put up with, you don't have to be nasty about it, but you know, something you thought um, this is just how it is. You set that boundary and you realize there's room for something else here. There's room for there to be more fairness and equality. All right? So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.